scrubby and it's interesting. This is what the bush looks like. <laughs> okay, that's a car. Hey guys, this is Tash, the Starcross Stitcher. Again, uh, today is um, it's Sunday, Mania the 28th, uh, 2017. And the piece, the whip I'm going to work on today is this, that probably a lot of people have seen. It's called Fire and Ice, artwork by Charlene Linscog Osorio, and the chart is from Custom Crafts. Um, I started, this is probably my oldest current whip. I started this maybe 2005 or something. Um, yeah, it's pretty old and it's about time I finished it. Wow, it looks gross in this. It's really hard to, f to film this um, on the black. Uh, it just never shows up right. Anyway, so you can see I've done kind of the top of the horse's head. This is the top two pages. Uh, yeah, maybe you can see which part I've done. There's his eye just poking there. So I guess tonight I'm going to sort of work on this part of his his mane here. I might do these parts up here. <laughs> Just a bit of shading up in the middle of nowhere, lots of counting. Oh, I started this so long ago um, and I really loved it when I started it, but now I kind of don't love it. Um, but I'm going to at least work on it. And if I, I'm then if I finish it, I'll give it to my friend Tara because she does love horses. Um, and then if I don't like it, I'll just give it to Tara to finish if she wants to, or I'll just chuck it. I don't know. Um, I didn't find the stitching on black was a big problem. It's 32 count black Belfast linen. Um, that wasn't a huge problem for me. I just, I just, I don't like this. I've got dog hair on it. I used to have a dog when I started this, a white dog. You can see that. That's her hair. Bless her heart. Um, yeah. Yeah, my stitches just look messy and I don't like this kind of I guess, I guess nowadays I'd call it confetti stitching. Maybe I should um, grid and park this. That might make it easier to stitch. I'm not sure. I don't know. Not tonight, though. Tonight I'll just work on some of this, probably. See how much I can get done. And see if I have the desire at all to finish stitching this. We'll see. Alright, guys. Um, I got back from Vivid. Vivid was fantastic. It was so fun last night. We did lots of walking. We're both really sore. <laughs> um, and we um, had a great time. The lights were fantastic. It's really nice to be home, though. Of course, unfortunately, work is tomorrow. <laughs> so, yeah. Oh, I'm really tired, if you can t probably tell from the way I'm talking. All right, guys, I'm going to do a little bit of stitching on this. And then I will see you tomorrow with a new start. Bye-bye.